Hey everyone, my name's Ina and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm just doing this intro outdoors, so I do apologize if it is a bit noisy. And uh, today's video is going to be my perfume collection. Um, a lot of people actually requested for this video, but it took me a while to film it, so I do apologize for that. But better late than never, right? <laughs> anyway, just a short disclaimer. I am a perfume addict as much as I am a makeup addict. I have been collecting perfume since I was in college or high school, so it has gotten a bit crazy. And don't judge me. Enough with all of this rambling, let's get started with the video. Okay, so this is what it looks like right here. I just put it on top of my um, two small plastic cabinets right here. Let's go ahead and start. Uh, I'll probably start with these perfumes right here since that kind of makes more sense, right? <laughs> so the first one is this Calvin Klein Euphoria perfume. And this was actually given to me by Kenneth. It actually smells really, really classy. Pang mayaman talaga yung amoy niya. And yeah, actually, it, I think it kind of smells a bit pang oldies. <laughs> so I don't really like using it that much. As you can see, marami pa siyang laman. See? I don't use it a lot. So yeah, marami pa siya. The next perfume is some friend, some friend from Calvin Klein as well. This one is the Eternity Moment for Women, and this is just I think the travel size. This was given to me by my tita from the U.S. Thank you so much, Tita Pin. And yeah, I've actually been using this a lot every time I go out of the house. Um, I think I've mentioned this in a favorites video not so long ago. And as you can see, konting konti na lang siya. And I'm actually um, trying to save it up because I don't want that moment to come na maubos na siya. <laughs> this is definitely one of my favorites. Super pang mayama din ang amoy. It smells very classy and I just really, really like it. Next up is a perfume or an eau de toilette. I don't know how to say that. From Victoria's Secret. This is a perfume that I've had since third year college. And I stopped using it ever since Andito Nasha. Because it just smells really, really good. It smells really girly, it smells really fresh. And it actually has a floral scent to it. For me, it kind of smells like Sampagita or Ilang Ilang. <laughs> I really, really like it. And it's called Secret 66 by Victoria's Secret. I haven't seen this scent in any Victoria's Secret counters here in Cebu. But tell me if you see this and I will definitely buy it. Up next is something again from Victoria's Secret. This one right here is Sexy Little Things Noir Summer. And this one is actually a body mist as you can see. And konti na lang din siya because I stopped using it since it got here. I have that problem of not using perfumes anymore. If I one eight na lang siya, I stop using it because I don't want na siya. I have a problem, guys. All right, up next is something from Victoria's Secret again, and this one is the Dream Angels Heavenly Body Mist, and this is actually one of my favorite scents from Victoria's Secret by far. I just really love it. For me, it has that powdery scent to it which just makes you smell super fresh and super clean. And that's just one of my favorite, favorite kinds of scents. I really, really like it. Moving on is something that I got from my sister. This was actually her gift to me. It's the Rose Baby Eau de Perfume. And as you can see, it has a rose or a flower on the bottle. This actually also smells really, really nice. Um, the bottle is super nice as well, as you can see, and I actually stopped using it because I've been using some of my other perfumes, but this one smells really nice as well. It smells kind of like the um, CK Euphoria, but it's a bit muted, so yeah, I've really been liking this. Up next is something that Kenneth's dad gave to me. This is the Sarah Jessica Parker Twilight Eau de Perfume Spray from the Lovely Collection. And that's what the bottle looks like. It looks really classy, right? It looks really nice. And yeah, I think he got this from Duty Free when he got home one Christmas. It was so nice of him to give something to me. The smell is really kind of mild. Marami pa siya because I don't use it that much because it does mean a lot to me because his dad gave it to me. Up next is something na nasa box pa. <laughs> so this is the Boom. I don't know how to read that. Green tea, cherry blossom. This here, John Arthur Paris. I don't know if I said that right, but 
the box looks really really nice, right? Kenneth actually bought this from me from SM because he bought ng perfume and he bought one for me as well. I think this was 900 pesos from SM because they sale sila, uh, from I think 1,000. 600 I forgot and he gave this to me about a couple of years ago but I haven't used it yet because my sentimental value shot. the next one is this Victoria's Secret very sexy temptation fragrance mist and this actually smells really fresh um, it smells quite classy as well it doesn't smell fruity or floral it has that classy scent to it this was actually given to me by a friend I don't use it that much Alright, now let's move on to this side of the perfume corner collection. <laughs> the first one is this, I don't know how to read this, Eclat d'Arpege by Lanvon. Lanvon? Lanvon? <laughs> I don't know how to say it. I actually bought this from my classmate who sells U.S. Authentic Perfumes. I think I got this for only 2000 or one eighth. I forgot. This is my favorite perfume by far. It just smells very classy and super tagal na wala ng amoy niya. And plus the packaging is super nice as well. So you don't want to throw it actually. <laughs> just looks really classy. That's why it is on the front of the perfume collection. Next up is this Paris Hilton perfume. I think this is also a travel size. I included this in a haul video not so long ago and this was actually given to me by my cousin from the US. Thank you Atiwina. She knows that I love perfume so yeah. Thanks for giving this to me. Actually this is one of my favorite favorite scents ever since I was in high school or college. I think early college or late high school. Um, this was my everyday perfume before and it just brings back so many memories when I use it. Up next is this unflattering perfume right here because I lost the, um, what do you call that? Pang spray? <laughs> Sprayer? But yeah. But it's from Donna Karen Cosmetics and it is in the scent Cashmere. Cashmere Mist. This actually smells really nice, really classy, but I just need to find like a cap for this one. All right, up next, this is actually not a perfume, but I use it as a perfume. It's the Davidoff Cool Water Aquatics Woman, and it's actually a cooling liquid powder. Now, as I said, it's a liquid powder, but I use it as a perfume because it smells super great. Um, it actually smells more potent than the perfume one of this Davidoff Cool Water collection, which is why I really, really like it. I just put some on my nape or and on the back of my ears and here on my wrist and I'm good to go. Next up is something from my mom and as you can see, super konting konti na lang talaga siya. This one is the Elizabeth Taylor Sparkling White Diamonds Eau de Toilette. Guys, look at the packaging. It is super, super nice. My mom actually gave this to me and alam naman ya that I love sparkly stuff. So yeah, I really like the packaging which is why I don't want to finish it because I just want to store it here on my perfume cabinet. <laughs> this smells really classy as well. Pamayama talaga ang amoy. And Kenneth actually really, really likes this scent on me because, I don't know. <laughs> I think it smells quite sexy for him. Next up is this perfume from Christian Dior. And again, konting konti na lang siya. I don't want to finish it again. <laughs> I have a problem, guys. This is the Diorissimo Eau de Toilette. I really like the packaging of this perfume. It comes in a frosted glass packaging and the cap is really nice as well. I really, really like it. Okay, the next perfume is my Chanel Number no. 5 perfume. Smells really nice, smells really classy. Pang mayaman talaga. <laughs> Here's the next perfume. This is actually something from my mom and it just says exclamation. The packaging is also really nice. It actually comes in a glass packaging and this cap is just plastic. When you open it up, it looks like that. See? And actually this has a kapartner na lotion. Here, as you can see, exclamation body lotion. These actually smell really, really nice. They smell quite powdery. They have that powder scent to them, which makes you smell super nice and fresh. It doesn't really make you smell very perfumey, if you know what I mean. Alright, so the next perfume is this Issey Miyake Eau de Toilette. Um, Kenneth actually gave this to me, and as you can see, konti na lang din ang natitira. I stopped using it because konti na lang siya. And I don't want to throw it away kasi may sentimental value because Kenneth gave it to me. 
But yeah, this is my second favorite perfume because I just love the scent. And I love the bottle, and I love everything about it. Moving on, I have this perfume from my sister. It's the Eliza Ashley Green Tea Essence Eau de Toilette. She actually gave this to me a few years back, but I stopped using it because I don't really like green tea scents, if that makes sense. Yeah, she gave this to me, so I just keep it here in my perfume collection drawer, or in my perfume collection corner. It really, really smells like green tea. Up next is something from the same friend who gave me this Victoria's Secret perfume. It's the Impressions de C. Brands. I don't know if I said that right. The bottle looks super nice, right? It comes in a frosted glass packaging and when you open it up, it looks like that. It smells quite fresh as well and pangmayaman as well. Next up is another perfume that Kenneth gave to me. This is the Elizabeth Arden Green Tea Scent Spray Eau de Perfume. And as you can see, marami pa siya because as I said, I don't really like green tea scent, so I don't use it that much. Sorry, Kenneth. As you can see, andito pa siya. Um, he actually gave this to me like three or four Christmases ago. And I'm sorry, Kenneth. I haven't used it up yet because I don't like green tea scents. I don't know why you don't know that. Next up is something that my sister gave to me. This is the VS in Paradise with Love Collection Ocean Bloom. Sea Breeze Apple Blossom Fragrance Mist from Victoria's Secret. I really do like the scent. It's unlike other Victoria's Secret perfumes which smell fruity or florally. This one actually smells really fresh, parang bagong ligo lang. And I really like that about this. Alright, so we're almost done guys. I'm sorry if this video is quite long. <laughs> this one is the Victoria's Secret Midnight Exotics Deep Berry Body Mist. And hindi ko pa siya nabubuksan as you can see because I actually still have other fragrance mists in my collection. I'm just storing it here because I'm a hoarder. Right, so the last perfume is this one. This is the Wild Daffodils Eau de Perfume. It says here, Story of Love. <laughs> Actually, nabili ko to like 70 pesos or 80 pesos lang from APM Mall. And it actually really smells super nice. It stays on your body for the good amount of the day. And the packaging is also super nice and classy looking. I really, really like it. I don't know if you will like the scent of this purple color, but for sure, yung pink magugustuhan niyo yung scent. This is just my everyday perfume kasi super cheap lang niya. <laughs> Alright, so that is the end of my perfume collection. I hope that I did not bore you. I know there are a lot. I know there are a lot of perfumes in my collection, but it was requested, so I hope you did enjoy watching. If you did, don't forget to give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel if you're not yet subscribed. I make videos every three days or as often as I can. And please comment down below if you have any video requests, like what kind of video on my certain collections would you want me to do a video on? And that's all. Just leave me your comments, any questions that you have for me. I will be happy to answer all of them. And I love reading all of your comments. So again, thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you in the next one. Bye!